Hey guys, next up we're going back a little bit. We're talking about the Kingdom Air Razor. I planned on initially getting the uh, the two pack with Inferno and Air Razor, but I already have Inferno, so I just decided to just get the Kingdom Air Razor and um, be done with it. So front of the box you got Air Razor's Beast Mode or Robot Mode. Bottom of the box, side of the box, back of the box, Air Razor, Air Razor, top of the box. Yada yada. So air razor. Um, I've commented before that I'm not a big fan of this mold. Um, because I wasn't a big fan of Skywarp, I think it was. Yeah, Skywarp, the one that came with a, a side swipe. And um the Rise of the Beast one's not great. This is the best version that I own. I'm still not huge on it, but of all the air razor all the versions of this mold, this is definitely the best one. Um she looks she looks good in bird mode, aside from the bottom, but you know it is what it is. And, um, yeah, I don't really have much to complain about in beast mode, so we're just going to pull these pieces off and rotate these legs down to get her started into robot mode. So we'll get those legs down, we'll turn the feet around, straighten those out. There we go. Get these arms out of the way. Arms out of the way. Turn around, fold up the shoulder pads. Turn the waist around, and we will start separating some things. So we'll get this back piece open. We'll fold all of that up, and we'll straighten all that out. And the bird head will plug into the waist right there. There you go. And we'll start folding the wings back, connecting them into place, just like that. Oh, come on, just clip it. There you go. Oh, and then make sure, you know, the legs are in the right orientation. And there we go. We got Air Razor in her robot mode. And she looks pretty solid. Uh, she looks like Air Razor, for sure. And I do think she looks a lot cooler than um, Skywarp did and the Rise of the Beast one. I think this is definitely the best looking of this mold that I have. So that's neat. Articulation-wise, her head is on a full 360. Can look up, can look down. Rotation at the arms, in and out, turn the bicep, elbow, no wrist, but that's okay. She's got a waist swivel, legs can go forward, can go back. You can move this piece too if you want some more leg movement. She's got a knee joint, pretty heavy one, and uh, she has a ball joint in her foot. So she has good articulation. And she's pretty solid. Um, again, not my favorite figure ever. Um, I don't, I'm not like a huge fan of this mold in general. But um, of the ones I have, this is definitely the best version. Though I will say, if you want this mold, you're probably just better off getting the um, the two-pack one that's going to come with Inferno. Because it is going to be better painted than this one. And this one does a good enough job. And it will be fine on my Beast War shelf, which you can probably see back there. But, you know, nothing fancy. Nothing amazing, but nothing terrible either. Um, if you're an Air Razor fan, this is probably the best you're going to get until they make a masterpiece. Hopefully. Uh, but they take forever to make these Force Masterpieces, so who knows? But I think she looks pretty decent, and um, I think you'll enjoy her too. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and um, we'll stick around for more. Take care.